Peace and prosperity be unto all who's listening and watching. It's your girl Shay Miller, right? And I'm back with another video. And guys, the holidays are finally here. All days have finally approached. The hustle and grind never stop. And honestly, guys, I'm super excited to go back and see my family. But I'm also happy to be off. Though I've been working hard to establish myself, to maintain stability, and to have this financial abundance and breakthrough in my life. What is really important is being around people you know and people you love. And though I haven't been alone without my family, I still miss them very much. Miss getting on the nerves, miss eating all their food, miss, miss, miss them. Now up here in where I'm at, um, at my new jobs, I use this word bucko a lot. And I use bucko all the time at Slim Chicken and at HMS. Some people are like, don't call me a bucko, call me a MF. You know what that means. And then some people are like, bucko, what that mean? And then some people use the word bucko. And other if people text me, they're like, bucko needs this or I don't, know, I don't know where I started saying that because I didn't get it from anybody. But I do have this innate habit of creating words that either don't exist or are real, but I add extra letters and words to the word, making it in an entirely different word in the dictionary. I mean, honestly, and I need to get better at that because I still do that, make up things or call things things that they're not. So I need to work on that. And as much as I'm working on being conscious, competent, which is aware at all times, being mindful of what I'm doing and what I'm saying at all times, being around my, being aware of my surroundings and things like that, as much as I'm getting better and improving and all that, um, I still need to work on my words. But ultimately, I'm doing better. I feel at peace and I'm feeling like I'm in a position of growth that I've never been before. Now, that I couldn't say before, but I can say now. Being in a position of growth, meaning there's infinite ways to do so. Infinite sources, infinite unknowns. There's so much that can go into the depths of the growth. If you ever get in a place in life where you're not growing or you feel like you're stagnant, you need to put yourself in a position where you're constantly growing and constantly having to face challenges. Um, today, my job got off early, my first job. They got off at like two o'clock. And I was thinking in my head, I was like, I get paid $13 an hour. My check full is good. My check not full, not good. So what I did, I just stuck around and swept and did whatever I could till my regular time to get off. Like, I'm not getting off early because if you pay more, I probably would consider it, but you don't. Which I'm not complaining about the pay because it obviously is enough to get me the things I need and do so much more because I've always had the bare minimum and done so much more with that. So I never made an excuse for why I couldn't make more or why I couldn't do more to make the 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 amount enough you know what i'm saying so that the price the number the amount of hour or whatever doesn't matter to me in a sense of it's a necessity though it should be a requirement honestly i'll make ends meet regardless but i do believe that i should work my full hours in order to receive a full check therefore if i get a full check i could always maintain the living that I'm living and also I finally I finally today's my last day at my other job meaning no more work for the holidays meaning it's quitting time no it's not quitting time permanently but I don't go back to work till Tuesday what Monday for Slim Chicken, Tuesday for HMS. So that's what we're looking at, guys. My schedule is fully packed with 
things I need to do and things I want to do. So I'm fully focused on gaining my energy back and I also need to redo my hair, honestly. But that's a work in progress every day.